Hello everyone, I am Fajar Purnama and on this video I would like to install some to the to demonstrate some Steam games on Kali Linux. And so uh, unlike the Linuxes from a long time ago which is quite hard to actually play some games in it. Well today Linux have got advanced and you hardly need to do anything to play any games it's the dependencies in other words are mostly pre-installed so this is my system the Kali Linux rolling is based on Debian and my memory is 11 12 gigabyte the processor is Core i7 and this is the size of my disk in the previously Kali Linux problem, the one of the ones when the first time it came out is the video driver is not compatible to a laptop with two video graphic card installed on it. So as you can see here that I have a an Intel on board and an NVIDIA GeForce it's 720M in this back then the video driver was problematic and in the dis on the display setting hmm. sorry to wait for a bit but here on the display setting it wouldn't show any resolution only one and that's when I realized that the, it's the video pro video driver that is the problem but now it has quite advanced and they fix the video driver and was able to be compatible with a Optimus laptop which is which means that it has two graphic cards in it and so on this video I would like to try installing a uh, steam game to demonstrate some steam games and try to play and using this driver uh, previously it was not I didn't get to use the full power of my laptop but at least I'm able to play on Ubuntu or Debian you shouldn't have any problem since you can switch from this driver to NVIDIA driver and usually NVIDIA driver works better so before that let, um, let me install a steam application oh wait steam device so steam was removed from here I guess so so in that case we need to download the steam uh, that package from the website there are some problems back then when I first installed steam on the way which one of them is I need to install the 32 bit architecture also okay let me log in oh long login okay got it now install steam also available on windows on mac so we already detect that i'm using a linux system yes steam latest depth safe ok 
Okay, I'm going to open this. Uh, I mean, open the folder. And I'm going to put this on my programs. Hmm. This thing is better to sort by type. Okay, that's good. Do I have steam here? No, I don't. And let me create one. Steam. Now open the terminal. Now I'm on this folder. Then to install a dev package is the command dpkg kg min i install and then steam latest. Okay, you need a super user preprint. And why don't I be a super user? Hmm. Oh, what the? Maybe I type too fast. Okay. D D P K G min I the package and see what happens. and if you have enough of this you can actually uninstall this theme using this dpkg as well just search on the on the web how to uninstall a dev package okay now it is installed let me go well in the application maybe where does it it probably in games and then steam yes okay downloading update and for the game that I want to test the best game to test for me now is actually Dota where I can see the FPS and I can set some settings mm, okay yeah, it's done on the other hand, I do have a Windows on this machine, but mm, making a video on Windows is already very common. If I can play on Steam, then if I can play on Linux, then why not try? Fade to load Steam UI. So we came with some problem, but I probably knew is about the 32-bit architecture. Well, but let's just search. Let's just search what the problem is. Let's just search on the internet so to show you how to actually come around this problem. Oh, no, no, this one. Okay, so this isn't the one that we're looking for. Let's try this one.
wait did I run as a sudo oh no I didn't okay then I don't know what it cause of it then why don't just run steam it's already in the terminal and this way we can really see what really preventing steam to start 64 bit here it is here is the problem that it needs a 32 bit package okay then why don't we try installing this end there will Okay. Okay, have to be root. Okay. Then let's try this one. Okay, then this is one way to try to fix some problems and here are some things Okay, so he said just to install the thing. So let's search for the packet. I have aptitude already. Libgeo one. If you don't have aptitude, install aptitude. Okay. I guess I have to. I guess I have to activate the 32 bit architecture. Wait. Ah, uh, not here. Sorry, guys. I did a lot of mess. Okay, now yeah, update. Let's see again. There it is. It's here. It need this one, the 32 bit. Okay. And there is new video. Well, it's probably for later. So we need to install this one. The means a def. This one and then this one and then don't forget one more which is the lip C or something mm. man this is so hard to locate I right, hear it is Oh, 
Ooh, so much. Suggested package. Okay. I'll think about that. The following package will be installed. The following package will be removed. Okay, I'll better remember this. Just in case. and then touch note the text and then echo this ah. and just no no okay. after we finish uh, installing then we start the steam okay no version information available so starting the steam from the terminal you can see what's actually wrong with it so this is one other problem let me fix it and now I went to some to some site to see what's wrong with this and I found a solution to delete this okay other way you can just go into the folder itself and delete this Okay, but this command will just go into and search for this and then delete if it's fine if it's found okay so it deleted all the error thing all the error library and let's start again I don't know what this does though but I hope it's not something wrong but if it's working for now then should be alright okay so the steam actually started log into the system account okay I guess I have to go to a code hope I already now I'll use my handphone so wait a moment guys let me look for the code that I should enter So there are two problems with Steam in installing Steam here. One is that it this error thing is need to match on its own library and the second one that we need to do is to install the 32 bit packages. Okay now I got my code. Okay. Now it's done. Hey, I can install all this. 
I thought these are for oh no it's game purchase okay now I can see which I can install which I cannot wait Bioshock Bioshock Infinite is for Linux okay counter strike can be installed on Linux so I purchased this game because when I when I look at my wish list most of them are from 50 to 80 percent off and I'm not going to miss those chances but let me before playing let me check okay this one cannot wait devil may cry oh no I cannot dread out okay dread out I'll play dread out and do <laughs> fear not for windows only Magnet, okay, half life, of course. It's Linux. What else? Left for Dead. What? I bought Left for Dead? Or, or it's free to play? Oh, it's in a package. I bought the bundle. And then Blade, only Warband is for Linux. And this one, I got a crazy 70% off. 80 per 70 or 80 I forgot but it was the huge discount so no way I'm missing Ooh, this one is for Linux cool let me try it and do yep that's it that's that and okay this is the wish list no no discount for now okay then let me install Dota. I'm going to install this home local share steam. I have this pastry card is 16, this pastry blue this much. Okay. Okay, that's it for the wait. Okay. That's it for the video. On the next video I'll be doing a gameplay. But for now is enough for installing steam. Thanks.